YouTube was good. It's we Eli and I'm back here on another video. Today for you guys I come up with my fresh cut method. We got a fresh cut yesterday. I came home, you know, I saw I brush my hair for two seconds and I put my do-rag on. I didn't really get a session yesterday because I was really busy. So today for you guys I'm coming with my fresh cut method. Like, comment, and subscribe. And also you guys let me know if you guys think I gained progress or not. Without further ado, you guys, let me show you guys how I'm looking. This is how I'm looking after the cut. I got a two with the grain after a six week wolf. All right, you guys, so now I know the first question you guys always ask is what should I do when I get home? First thing I'm gonna tell you guys, don't wash your hair. Because I get a lot of DMs of people asking me, a lot of people will say, you know, what about the loose hairs? Don't wash your hair. What I like to do or what I did yesterday too, I take an old brush but for me, you guys, um, I have a lot of brushes. So like this brush specifically, I just use this brush after my fresh cut. So I come home, I use this brush. It's a soft brush. See, it's chipping, I'm gonna use it daily. So I come home, I take this brush and I just brush out all the loose hairs. I just brush out all the loose hairs. And then after you do that, you guys, you just wanna you know, moisturize, get a lengthy session and rack up. Cause after a fresh cut your hair is gonna be like kind of dry because you did a wash and style the night before your cut so you, you want to moisturize your hair again and also you guys you want to put in hella work because you just cut off all that hair now your hair is real low and it's easier for you to gain progress so you just want to put in work i know some of you guys you know when you get a fresh cut you're real relaxed or whatever because your hair is short, you just got a fresh cut, whatever, but it's not time to relax, it's time to put in the most work. So what I'll recommend, I'll recommend you get like a medium brush. This is a medium to you know, pro. Get a medium and a soft, and get a moisturizer. You can either get a moisturizer, or you can get an oil, or both, or you can also use a butter. But what I don't recommend is a pomade. If you're still in the ripple stage and you're still a beginner, then I recommend you use this. This is 360 style pomade. You can use this if you're a beginner, but you know, like if you're not a beginner, if you're past the ripple stage, then just use a moisturizer or a butter or an oil. For you guys today, I'll be using this As I Am Double Butter Cream. You guys know this is my favorite moisturizer. I'll be using that, and then I'll be following that up with some grapeseed oil. This one of my favorite oils right now. So, I'm gonna add this on top of that for some shine and the seal it in. So all right, you guys, I just showed you guys everything you need to do. I explained, I told you guys what to do. Now it's just time to put in that work. So you guys can pick up a brush and brush with me.
you guys that's the end of the video as always like comment and subscribe go on the way to 2k subscribers if you want to get this do rag link will be right here and then link will also be in the description and you know as always you guys stay with you